to light heavyweight showcase between the former Pride champion, Dan Henderson, and Jimmy Poster Boy Manawa. <coughs> Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight fight. Manawa is 36. Henderson is 45. Manawa is two inches tall. He will have a five inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding professional record of 15 wins, two losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, Jimmy Oscar Boy. Dan Henderson, Jimmy Manoa, and here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Manoa, black trunks for Henderson. Dan Henderson, when he returned to the UFC, fought at light heavyweight, trying to unify the belt with Quentin Rampage Jackson, the UFC champion. And Joe, that fight went the distance. Yeah, it went the distance, and what was one of the things that was surprising about that fight was how much Dan Henderson fought off of his back. And he showed some versatility in losing that fight, but he also showed that he's probably best suited for the 185-pound weight class. Nice hook to the body by Henderson. Flying all over the place early, big shot. Dan Henderson looking for another highlight reel knockout. The one against Bisping Joe, one of the greatest in MMA history. Nice strikes land. Manawa with a solid leg kick. Looking for the suplex. And he's down. And he comes over to the top of the head. With that punch. Postured up. They're back up. And there's a nice straight by Henderson. He slips the wow. punch. Oh my, he got rocked. This could be it right here. Swing and a miss. Powerful right here. Wow. Nice combination. Strong jab. Oh, he's landing at will. Oh, huge kicks. Oh, that's a vicious kick. That's a, a solid that hook. hook. Huge uppercut misses. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. That's wow. a big uppercut he just landed. Solid shot to the body. Some massive kicks. Oh, oh nice uppercut. Hard jab. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. Henderson looking for the H bomb. Oh, oh, big right hand clipped him. Vicious combination. Big shot. Oh, that's a good shot right there. Very good shot. Seconds. Manoa gets the takedown late in the round. And the mount. Mount. full mount. Not good. And the Stop. round is over. Huge takedown in the final seconds. Let's take a look at some of the action here. Really excellent striking being displayed. There you go, second round. You ready? Are you ready? Second round. Starting off this round, you got to think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's going to want to move and avoid taking damage early. Great counter jab by Manoa. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Caught him right on the bridge of the nose. Both men landing in that exchange. Oh, he's starting to tee off. Excellent job of landing punches here. 
He's starting to land those kicks to the body. As we break down the fight, his significant strike has been the body kick. Very good exchanges here. Lands a nice left. Combination. Henders. Oh! Wow! He's stumbling. Wow, he goes down. Oh! Beautiful up kick. Just missed with the big left. with a kick to the midsection. He's doing some damage with those kicks. Hard kick lands. Big power jab. Jab. Great exchanges. Oh, he tagged him with that straight. That's a hard inside leg kick. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here. Nice hook. It appears that cut is getting worse. And he got clipped again. Joe, 10 seconds left in the second round. Good punch by Manawa. And the end of the round. That's a nasty cut, Joe. Dan Henderson's nose is a mess. That's about incredible highlights in that. Here we go, let's go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's Five go, minutes go. remains in the fight. Beautiful right leg kick there. Henderson gets caught with the left. You can hear that one. He blocks the punch. Good connection with the straight by Manawa. Nice, oh, nice. leg kick. Oh, oh kick, kick. That hurt him. Jab, jab. Oh, nasty right hand. Vicious combinations. Oh, big shot. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Oh! Big straight punch. Whoa! This could be it. Oh, he's landing. Big shot just missed. There's a nice combination. Getting nasty. 
Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Jimmy Banner is continuing to punish that wounded eye. And you can see that the swelling continues to get worse and worse. He's absolutely targeting that eye. You can clearly see, and he's landing combinations on it repeatedly. There he goes with a one-two. He's utilizing good footwork here, circling to the right. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Nice roundhouse kick to the body. He lands a head kick. A big kick. They're scoring. Oh, that hook did damage. Oh, very nice. Really good job of landing that series of punches. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Hit him with a the jab. They are exchanging here, Mike. Big close with a huge left. Great fight. And they go the distance. So as the judges render their decision, Jimmy Manuel has surely done enough to come away with the win. Yeah, he was definitely the more active fighter, the more accurate fighter, and I agree, he should come away with the win. And again, here in round two, beautiful technique here. Times that strike perfectly. Round three, beautiful technique in this punch here, and it finds its way to the head. And here's Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest. 30-27, 9-28, 29-28. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Jimmy Hoster Manawa. Jimmy Manawa earns the victory by unanimous decision.